Firebirds are feeling it. Our guy Tim O'Brien was out there as they grabbed a 2-1 series lead over the Bears, and Tim joins us right now. All right, so they've got the uh, the series lead again. Yeah, that's the swing game, right? That, that game three is important. Game four now, if you can put your skate on their throat, so to speak, and run away with this thing. Uh, you were there. That was uh, as good a first period, as, as quick a game as we've seen the Firebirds look all postseason. Yeah, Firebirds came out very aggressively. Mm -hmm. They were putting the puck on the net. They were dominating controlling play. And to me, it looked like Hershey was kind of caught back on the back of their skates. Yeah, they looked like a team that went seven the previous series, just took a road trip cross country, and I think it caught up to them a little bit. And uh, Firebirds look good. They looked really good last night. And the uh, goalie for uh, Hershey, yeah, he looked to me completely out of sorts. Uh, rattled, lost uncomfortable and, and that's an assist to the fan base i think they were loud uh he did not look good in the crease whatsoever yeah did you see he, it was kind of like he was frenetic <laughs> he was just moving around like this yeah. and i thought uh oh yeah this guy's in trouble and, and i think that shows to to tip the cap to todd nelson the the bears head coach pulling the goalie in that moment get his head straight for game four you know you're not coming back well, let's turn the page to the next one. That was a good, that's a veteran coaching move. I'll tell you, uh, if you were out there last night, you saw some stuff that I had not seen before. The pregame with Fuego uh -huh. flying in from the ceiling. That was nuts. It was uh, pretty cool. I and mean, he practiced it and, and uh, it took a lot of time to get into that. And then the, the scissor lift that he went up in. Uh, I love that. That was cool too, yeah. H had you ever seen the, were you there in the seat for puck drop yet? What time did you get over there? No, I got there at 718. The minute the puck dropped, Hershey took a penalty they put the wrong guy out from their starting lineup. It was a bench miner. I've never seen that before. I've never heard of that before, but somebody caught it, and uh, it was pretty good. Have you ever seen that? Heard I've that? never, yeah. ever seen that. It was in my pretty life. wild. All right, so now they're up 2 1. They play again tomorrow night. Win tomorrow night, commanding 3 1 series lead, have a chance to wrap it up Saturday. Yeah, I think if you win, uh, you they say the closing series, the closing game's the hardest one to win, right? But if they take care of business, play the way they did last night on Thursday, I think uh, we might be celebrating here in the Valley on Saturday. All right, see you tomorrow night. Yeah, let's do it. Thanks, Tim.